Yo, what's up guys, this is Fade, and today I'm going to be going over some useful sniper spots that can cut off rotations, get you frags, and can give you information about where the enemy team is going. Okay, so first let's start off with this spot coming out of base. If you crouch underneath this train, you can see if the enemy team slides onto one and make the call for your team. Um, this spot is mostly an informational position. Uh, it lets you know where the enemy team is going. Okay, and the second position is quite similar. Uh, it can be used to make calls and get frags. All you need to do is prone underneath this train fast enough. Okay, and the same thing with this third position. All you really need to do is peek through this small crack and you can see if the enemy team is crossing, but it doesn't work if they slide. You won't be able to see them, but if they're just running and they cross, you'll be able to see them cross. And from all of them, this is the safest position since you're not on tracks. All right, now this position you need to boost up for and you basically jump on these boxes and watch to see the enemy team crossing from their top. Um, this position can grant you upper control if you're able to kill an enemy crossing and eventually stop their whole play. Uh, okay, so this is another good position where you can watch the enemy team cross from their top. Of course, you're at an advantage because you're already scoped in and because not all of you is showing. But this position is more risky because if someone is not watching too long way for a push, the enemy team can easily kill you from sight okay and this position is to watch top from on top of this garbage and this is a good spot to hold if you don't have top control and the enemy team does because you can easily pick them off when they peek window and you're also head glitched so it's harder for them to kill you all right this position here is a good place to cut off rotations because if your team has sight control and the enemy team is rotating one of the most places they rotate from is tracks and if you're here you can watch them rotating from tracks coming to site uh, you also have the advantage here because you're already scoped in and you're at a head glitch so, so it's much harder for them to kill you okay now this is more of an offensive position you basically come out of blackwood spawn into tracks and prone behind this box and you can see if the enemy team is crossing onto two and you can also get some kills here this position is for cutting off rotations because many teams boost up to take top two and when they rotate back they usually rotate from top so in this position you're able to see them rotating back and you can get some kills here delaying their retake okay so in this position you're able to stop the enemy team from taking top two by proning under this doggy hole if the enemy team is running to take top control they usually won't spot you but you but it's kind of a risky position because they can also see you from courtyard. This position can also be used to give information. You can make the call if the enemy team has top control or if they're taking top. Okay, and finally, this last position is in courtyard between these two boxes. There's a little crack that you can see through and the purpose of this position is to cut off rotations and to delay retakes. You can get many frags here, especially on snipers that like to play on tracks. And if you guys want to see me cover more maps, uh, let me know in the comments. So yeah, peace.